In this video, I will explain why Donald Trump is going to be a game changer for blockchain developers. Donald Trump is a very pro-crypto president and we are going to see big changes in the industry. We'll cover the economic impact, regulatory shift, VC investments, and what this all means for your salary as a blockchain developer. Let's get started. If you are new here, I'm Julian, and on Eat the Blogs, I help you to become a blockchain developer. So Bitcoin smashed through 75K right after the election result, and it's not just Bitcoin, the entire crypto market is pumping. The crypto world is very excited by the election of Donald Trump. Crypto political donors spent over $100 million on this election cycle, and most of it went to who? You guessed it, Donald Trump. But why is that? Donald Trump is very pro-crypto. He declared he wanted to make the US the crypto capital of the planet. This could mean several things, such as more blockchain projects getting greenlit, increased demand for blockchain developers, and potentially higher salaries as companies will compete for talent. So let's first look at the economic impact. Trump cares a lot about the economy. He is going to apply a lot of pressure on the Federal Reserve to lower interest rates. Lower interest rates will mean more money will be available for investment. This will boost the stock market and also the crypto market. Donald Trump is also seen as very pro-business. People trust him to steer the economy in the right direction and ultimately it will become a self-fulfilling prophecy because everybody will feel more confidence, people will invest more, spend more, work more, and in the end, the economy will flourish. Next, let's look at the regulatory aspect. Regulation is very important. No regulation is dangerous. Too much regulation is also dangerous. So what we want is the sweet spot where everybody feels comfortable to innovate in the space. Trump promised to end the anti-crypto crusade of the current administration. Specifically, Trump promised to fire SEC chair Gary Gensler. But why does this matter? Gensler has been seen as hostile to crypto, bringing lawsuits against major players like Binance and Coinbase. A new SEC leadership could mean faster approvals for crypto ETFs, clearer guidelines for blockchain projects, and less fear of sudden regulatory crackdowns. So now let's talk of investments. A lot of crypto projects are funded by VCs. VCs are investment funds that invest in technological companies. More VCs means more blockchain companies, which mean more blockchain jobs. And less VCs means less blockchain jobs. VCs are very sensitive to the regulatory environment. They don't want to invest in projects that will get into legal trouble. After the crackdown on crypto, we saw a lot of VCs leaving crypto for the AI sector. But now, with the new welcoming environment for crypto, we will see VCs returning to the crypto sector. So next, let's talk of a government crypto project. Donald Trump is very anti-CDBCs. And I think it's okay because most people in crypto are against this as well. It's not at all what we signed up for when we got in crypto. But where it gets interesting is with the project of a federal Bitcoin reserve. Trump mentioned this during the Bitcoin 2024 conference. The idea is to create a strategic government fund that holds Bitcoin. This could be useful to protect the US government against a huge devaluation of the US dollar. If this project happens, we could see a huge demand of blockchain developers for government project. Plus, it would be a very bullish signal for the crypto market. 
Next, let's talk of crypto mining. Trump also mentioned he wants to bring back some mining in the US and really it makes a lot of sense because if you are to accept crypto in the US, for strategic reasons, it's better to have more mining at home. After the election of Donald Trump, mining companies like Marathon Digital and Riot Platforms saw their stocks jump. But why does it all mean for blockchain developers? It means more jobs, better salaries and less career risk. More jobs because we will see more demand for blockchain developers coming from private companies but also from the government. Better salaries because the demand for blockchain developers and the supply is not going to adjust immediately. So currently the average blockchain developer salary in the US is around 150k per year. With the projected growth under Trump, we could see this push past the 200k mark. And finally, there will be less career risk because with a more welcoming regulatory environment, the demand for blockchain developers is going to be more stable and more long-term. And also at a personal level, there will be less risk to be sued by the government. So Trump re-election could be a massive boost for blockchain developers. From better economic outlook to regulatory relief to increase VC funding, the landscape looks really promising. So what so what do you think? Do you think so what about you? What do you think? Do you think the election of Donald Trump will be positive for crypto? Let me know in the comments down below. All right. That's it for today. Bye.